With the records management and document management demands on state and local agencies today, I thought I'd try and find a solution that might help them deal with some of their mounting data and documents. And that led me to the Kangaroo DVD and Blu-ray disc duplicator. There's a lot of agencies out there that store data on disks, and I thought this might be a handy way to help them solve some of their records management problems. The Kangaroo DVD and Blu-ray duplicator says that it's easy to use out of the box, and that if you follow the instructions, you'll be on your way to duplicating disks in no time. The problem is the instructions are 91 pages long, and the device really isn't that easy to use. The Kangaroo duplicator duplicates CDs at 52 times speed and DVDs at 22 times speed, and will even do Blu-ray discs at up to 8 times speed. The problem is the device is just not very user friendly. In this age of iPhones and touchscreens, the button-based LCD screen just isn't up to par. The menus are hard to navigate, and unless you go through the entire manual, it really takes a long time to get the duplication process up and running. Once you do finally master all the commands, it does its job admirably, but that could take days. The device comes equipped with a removable 250GB hard drive that's enough to hold about 50 full-length DVDs. It also features LightScribe, which will inscribe on a DVD or CD, whatever label you want. The model I tested is a single bay unit, though Kangaroo offers devices that have up to four DVD bays allowing for multiple duplications at a time. With this model, data is stored on the hard drive and transferred back onto the blank CD. One feature I do like about the Kangaroo duplicator is it works standalone, meaning you don't need a PC to duplicate any CDs or DVDs. Though it does work well once you finally figure out how to use it, I just can't recommend the Kangaroo duplicator due to its text-based menu with 15 options and multiple sub-options. It just doesn't meet the standards of today's interfaces people want and demand.